All right, mandatory minicamp wraps up for the Browns down at First Energy Stadium. Um, and take a look, a little bit of concern is uh, Denzel Ward, um, a lower leg injury. Uh, so he sat down after doing some of the drills, uh, went over, met with a trainer, and then ended up uh, walking into the locker room, did not return, no word on the nature or the seriousness of the update. Never want to see that, though. Uh, Deshaun Watson, working with the offense, finds David Bell, who just keeps catching the football and impressing. Um, uh, Watson this time will find uh, his newest favorite target, David and Joku. You can be sure those two will be hooking up. Um, they wrap up this uh, and this is a really good site 50 yard field goal Cade York showing off plenty of leg and uh, Quincy it's it's good to see Deshaun Watson and the guys I, I know it's it's not a lot they were down at First Energy Stadium and they were playing football I, I can't wait till we can talk more about that yeah 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 it's gonna be it's gonna be a long what month and a half now <laughs> where we're not really gonna have any type of football to talk about but, you know, um, it, it's going to be fun once the season starts just because whether or not Watson plays this year, I think this team still has the potential to be very good based on just what's on the roster and the strength of it. I mean, impact players all up and down that roster. As far as uh, Denzel Ward almost getting hurt, hey, man, just let him rest. You know <laughs> what I mean? Like, he's going to get on to uh, his, his break soon. So if Denzel Ward has a six-week injury, hey, look, I mean, that, that he wasn't going to do much until week th well, week one anyways, right? Like, how much do you need to figure out from Denzel Ward at this point of his career? You've already given him $70 million. You're pretty sure he could miss, like, most of camp, warm up for a week or two. He don't need to play any preseason games, right? Week one, just throw him out there. He can lock down somebody. So as far as Denzel goes, hey, at least they know about it. At least it's going to get treated. Um, and maybe it will prevent something bigger down the line. And also, you know, hey, like Denzel needs to be out there every week. He's not proving anything anymore, right? Like he's Denzel Ward. He's one of the best corners in this game. He can miss a couple weeks of practice. I think he'll be fine. Pull out some of that orange helmet bubble wrap. Put him in it and, and pull him out when you need somebody shut down. Um, what? Yeah, look, if you go into Berea during this <laughs> uh, this summer, just know, don't be mad when you see 21 on that bike because that's the best place for him to be because you can't get injured on that station. <laughs> yeah. And that's all we need, right? We don't need him to play during the preseason. What does that help us with anything? We need him during the regular season. So the more he's on that bike, the more I will applaud this health and safety staff because he's had uh, lower extremity issues before. He's had soft tissue issues before. So, you know, just don't need to use a lot of miles on him when you don't need to. And this is necessarily not a point where you need to use those miles on Denzel. 